Parkinson's is a movement disorder. I was diagnosed in 2003 with Parkinson's, all of your movements, and in fact, everything about your body becomes constricted. For me, everything slows down. When I would be walking on the sidewalk, I would feel like I was walking through mud or quicksand. Okay, class, walk with me. They have developed an app for Google Glass, and it consists of a, a little screen and this plastic piece that you put on, and they give you little visuals to follow. I took it out for a walk, and it's great for a walk because the person who's demonstrating the walk, she's walking and you walk along with her, and then, she, then the screen disappears and the music just keeps looping while you're walking, because walking to a music is very helpful, because it keeps you in a certain gait and you don't slow down. Make your Dance for PD offers free, specialized dance classes for people with Parkinson's. All of the strategies that dancers use to move and to control their movement and maintain balance and control their flexibility and use a wide range of uh, imaginative tools to initiate movement, all of those tools can be useful for people with Parkinson's. As a teacher, it's impossible for me to be with each individual student once they leave the studio. Google Glass is, in many ways, the perfect technology for translating the information that we try to get across in class into people's everyday lives. Twist. The exercise is really imperative to combat almost any kind of ill health. But with Parkinson's, it's particularly necessary because of the tendency of the body to constrict, just sort of twist in on itself. I think probably the visual keeps you honest in terms of the extent to which you put your all into an exercise. The dancers are so well trained and they do it so beautifully, you want to imitate them. And when you imitate them, you're doing the exercise better.